Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Jessie and in today's video I will be showing you my morning cleaning routine. Before we get into it, I do make videos every single week so make sure you hit that subscribe button and also turn on notifications so you don't miss anything. Good morning! Every morning I like to roll the blinds up and open the windows so my plants in the room get some nice fresh air and light. I made this in a frame to remind me of how grateful I am every morning. I then go on to making the bed. I like to make the bed every morning because I feel like it makes the room just look a lot more cleaner. We used to have a chair where we would throw clothes we've worn and it'll just build up on the chair but now we have this clothing rack for those clothes. Our coats and jackets will hang them up and I'll always end up folding clothes in the middle sections and inside the drawers to make sure everything is nice and neat and easy to find. I then go on to dusting some surfaces around the room. I kind of like to do one room at a time, so I will usually start with the bedroom. I'll dust our frames and also the shelves and just any surface area I come across. Because I dust every day, there's really not that much dust and it's just a quick light wipe every morning. I also like to make sure that the power outlets are off in the mornings if I've charged things overnight like my phone and if I don't need it I won't be turning it back on until I need it again. My ring light and my tripod is usually packed away if I'm not filming but if I am filming the day I will leave it there until I finish filming because I usually film in the mornings. It's super easy to put away, it's got its own storage bag and I just put it back into the wardrobe. I also like to make sure that all the wardrobe doors are closed and all the drawers are closed in the room in the morning because I just feel like it looks a lot more neater and tidier and it's just a much cleaner look. I also like to put everything away into the drawer so nothing's left hanging around, they all have a home. I then go on to checking all my plants in the room to make sure all of them are happy, nobody needs watering, there's no pests, and that they're good for the day. So this one here is a monstera that I propagated and look it's growing some roots. I also like to spin them around so the plants get even light all around. I'll then do some quick vacuuming, it's super easy with a stick vacuum and I'll go around the room and also into the bathroom because sometimes my hair is just everywhere. Next we're tidying up the bathroom and putting everything away where they're supposed to be. And I spray and wipe the glass so it's nice and clean. I also give the sink a bit of a wipe as well to make sure it's clean. For the sink I like to use a small toothbrush, I just find it super useful and just really helpful in brushing little bits of gunk away and just mold build ups. Once that's done, I straighten up the products that I use daily and I make sure that the bins are nice and empty, ready to start the day and I'll be changing them if I need. I'll also give the bin a bit of a wipe down too if it's dusty. Because I am in the bathroom, I like to check to see if there's any laundry that needs to be done for the day. Today I'll be doing all the towels and putting it into the washing machine so that it's washed and ready to go for the day. 
In the living area, I like to make sure that the cushions are straight. I also check on some of the plants in the living area, particularly the ones that require more light and attention, and to make sure they are watered, fertilized when needed, and everyone is happy. I usually won't let my plants sit there and collect dust. I like to wipe them off when they get dusty so they can better photosynthesize. Zuko's first birthday today so he's wandering around the house with a little bow on him. Happy birthday Zuko! Moving on to the kitchen area, I like to wipe out all the surface area benches. I do wipe them after dinner but if we have guests over or if we have dessert or if we eat something the tables may get a little bit sticky again so I make sure that everything is clean to start the day. I then empty the drying rack I wash any leftover cups or dishes from the sink, there's usually only about a few of them and put them into the rack to dry. Put any dishes that aren't put into the dishwasher in or take any dishes out that have been cleaned the night before. I also check on our coffee machine daily because sometimes there is liquid underneath and it needs to be rinsed. The stove actually gets wiped and cleaned every single day because I don't like the build up of oil and the smell. And if I haven't done it the night before, I will take down the exhaust and just put some detergent on and scrub it with its own little scrub. And just pour some boiling water over it and then some hot water just to get rid of the oil and smell and I feel like it's just a lot easier to clean when you're cleaning all the oil off every single day. So I'll usually put that back and wipe around it. And that is it for our morning cleaning video. I hope you guys have learned something or I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, turn on notifications. If you want to see more videos like this, please also let me know and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye now.